on that tomorrow. I think he's going to be a real contender all day long. You know, he hasn't always had the, the biggest opportunities and the best equipment. But, but if you go back a handful of years ago, he ran some races for Joe Gibbs Racing and, and did exactly what you would expect him to do uh, when he was driving that top shelf type car. This weekend, an RCR car at Talladega, they'll be in the game. Plenty of speed. And right now, he is clocking to lead the way in qualifying with only two cars left. And you know, Jeffrey's a veteran. You talked about, you know, how many chances he's had and the, the races he's run. He's a veteran. He's not going to go to bed nervous about this opportunity. He's going to be confident. 45, buddy. 45. 45. Larry Mack liked it. Yeah, he liked it a lot. Jeffrey Earnhardt, top of the board in qualifying with two to go. And the first of those, his teammate and Daytona winner, Austin Hill. I, I love you know, seeing Richard Childress down there with Andy Petrie, who's now running competition over at RCR, and Larry Mack, who's, who's back in that three car. You talk about a collection of history. So many iconic photos could be taken down there with those that really laid such a strong foundation many years ago. Look at this battle for the pole. Look like for the longest time, Austin Hill had the advantage, but here comes Jeffrey back. I think Earnhardt's going to hang on here. The three car stays P1, 52-51 for Austin Hill, and now only one remains. It's going to be a great storyline either way. The three car, or it's going to be Ty Gibbs who gets his fourth consecutive pole. Pretty good start to the season in qualifying, huh, Adam? Incredible. Isn't there some irony, and I said this earlier, but only one time in the history of the Xfinity Series has a driver won four consecutive poles. It was Austin Dillon in the three car. Now the three cars at the top, and you have Ty Gibbs trying to take that spot away, and in doing so would win a pole for a fourth consecutive race. This is the part of the track where we saw Jeffrey really Stretch it out on Austin Hill. So you have to think this is this this is gonna be the same with Ty Gibbs just being able to drive away late. Jeffrey Earnhardt on the pole in the three car at Daytona. Such a special moment, Regan. Well, it is a special moment. Adam, all smiles down here. You got a lot of people here supporting you right now, Jeffrey. The three car is going to lead the field to the green tomorrow afternoon. I tell you, this is uh, this is unbelievable, man. Uh, you know, we've we've this has been a dream of mine for years to get this opportunity, and man, uh, it's just everything's falling into place. The good Lord's taking care of us. All these people from Forever Long, they've uh, supported me tremendously. Super Puff, Dow Strong. All the guys at RCR, man, this is more them than, than it is me. All I got to do is hold a pretty wheel, and they uh, they prove time and time again to bring fast cars here to the super speedways. So uh, not a bad starting spot. We're going to try to keep her there all, uh, all race and uh, hopefully put this in victory lane. Good luck tomorrow, Jeffrey. First career pole for Jeffrey Earnhardt, and it comes in the three car at Talladega. RCR sweeps the front row for the third time here at Talladega Super Speedway. We can't wait for tomorrow. We're on Fox race day at three. We're racing at four. Cup Series qualifying 11 tomorrow.